No one likes a workshop injury, but they happen from time to time. I've got myself a black thumbnail, so I'm going to deal with that right now. There's my injury. I had a go at um, heating up a paper clip and burning through, but to be honest, it actually just got too creepy. Uh, so after about three touches of it, uh, I, I left it alone. But what I'm going to do instead is use this drill bit. It's a one millimeter, and I'm going to slowly take my time and relieve the pressure on this thing. At the moment, it is very sore, and uh, it's affecting my ability to do some jobs. So uh, this is very creepy, and I'm not enjoying it, but. The pain is quite sore, it's probably 7 out of 10, maybe 6 out of 10, I don't want to exaggerate it, but I've done this once before and had great relief. Basically the blood is pooling underneath my nail, putting pressure on the thumb underneath it, so I don't really have much to say at the moment, I'm sort of concentrating on the surgery. I'm just applying a little bit of pressure. Uh, to be honest, there's no way I would be doing this with a power tool. I can't feel any pain from this procedure. Nails are pretty tough. What I am hopeful of is that once I get through the nail, I'll get some relief by easing the pressure build up underneath the nail. Here we go. And I can tell you that was creepy, but the pressure has gone to probably, or the pain is probably now a three out of 10. It's honestly, it didn't, it didn't hurt. I'll just give that a clean, hang on. The nail's still clearly sore, and it's gonna be sore for a while, but that has, um, that's helped a lot. So it's just allowed the blood to release and uh, ease some of the pressure from underneath now. Uh, I don't know if I should say, I hope you enjoyed my video, but um, you know, it's just dealing with things that you don't plan for sometimes. Thanks for watching.